one more question that came over the social media verse. You told Ranveer that ambition is limited. It is a thought and not worth investing our life on it. Without goals or commitment or destination, how will, how will I even take my next step? And you also had the goal of Dhyanalinga. I'm really confused. One part of that uh, we've already answered about See, what you call as ambition is essentially a thought that you generated, isn't it? How did you generate this thought? Maybe people around you influence. And above all, essentially your ambition or your thought is only coming from the limited data that you already possess. Yes or no? Do you believe, many of you who are in twenties uh, or early twenties, do you believe Everything that you need to know about the world, all the possibilities that life may hold, you already have collected data about it? No. With what little you know, if you fix your life's goal, I think that'll be a poor life. Right now, you're in college, you can fix a goal. Within the stipulated period, I want to get out of the college. <laughs> Not too early because they threw me out, not too late because I didn't get out. <laughs> yes? Within the stipulated period, I want to get out. How I want to get out, whether I want to get out first class or first this, that, 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 how much I should know, that is a goal you can set. Because already it's a structured time, isn't it? Already it's a structured time. In this structured time, you set a goal. But you don't set a goal for your life, ruling out all the possibilities that may open up. So if you decide right now, this is what I'm going to become. I was talking about that in terms of, this is a problem in our families, in uh, Indian families. A three-year-old child, they will ask, what do you want to become? <laughs> that tiny little girl says, I want to become doctor. Oh, they're so happy. This is rubbish. Why a three-year-old girl is being made to decide what she should become? We don't know what's her genius, yes? What talent she has, what genius she has, you don't know. But instead of seeing how to unfold that, you're fixing that so early on and ending up with a very constipated life. So the important thing is human beings have immense potential. If this has to unfold, one important thing is you create a situation of balance and pleasantness within you. That means you're peaceful, joyful and balanced. If you're like this, every human being has a certain genius and this will start unfolding. When it unfolds, it will surprise everybody. Right now the problem is this in the world. Not even one percent of human genius actually blossoms. Rest get trapped in these kind of systems and systems and systems all over the place. Somebody gets trapped into earning a living, somebody gets trapped because they fell in love too early, you know? <laughs> something or the other, they get committed to something. So ambition means you got committed to a single idea which came from very limited data in your life, isn't it? Don't get committed to a limited idea. Limited ideas are okay short term. Right now I'm here for five years in this university, this is what I want to do in these five years, this is okay. But life must unfold, you must give it an opportunity to unfold. Only reason why you're committing yourself like this is, you are afraid of uncertainty. You think certainty has come because you pegged it there. I am going to be a doctor, doctor at the age of three. And you feel you, there is a certainty. This certainty is death-like certainty because it takes away all possibilities. It's important for a human being, life should be explored, many possibilities. Only then human genius will unfold and we have multifaceted human beings in the country. Otherwise, this has been our problem because we're concerned about earning a living. There was a time where everybody was a doctor in this country, now everybody is a software engineer in this country. This is not the way to go. If it's needed, we'll do that, that's not the point. But the important thing is, human genius must unfold. If you destroy that because you've fixed a peg in your life, it's very unfortunate.